Yo, yo, yo. Welcome back. This is uh, Lando is Living, obviously, for another Lando Reacts. If you haven't guessed, we're listening to the third song off of... You already know the name, dude. I'm going to butcher it again. Uh, the project is Lumifos. And uh, the song that we're listening to today, actually, we're going to switch on over to our other screen here. The song we got today is going to be The Venom He Was Hiding. This is the third one we got going. It's Hesperid, by the way. It's always easier to say it when I'm looking right at it, but not when I'm not. So we got a uh, Dysphoria Will Consume Me was the last one I just listened to, and then me ma Manipulation before that. We're going to do The Venom He Was Hiding, um, and then I'm going to let you know how I feel about it. Like always, I'm going to keep it real. I'm going to keep it a buck. If there's something I don't like, which honestly I don't know will happen on this project so far, I'm really, really liking it, uh, then I'll say it. If there's something I really, really do like, which has happened a lot on this project, so I'll probably say it. Uh, we're going to get right into this. I'm not going to hold you much longer, obviously, because we already know what we're doing here. We know this artist. We've been listening to this. Um, but I did want to touch on something. Remember when I came into this and I was like, I don't know what genre this is. I'm not quite sure what's going on. To answer my question, it was right below me this whole time. The genre is atmospheric, melodic, depressive, suicidal black metal also known as Black Gaze. What a mouthful. He's right about that one. We're going to get right into this. I'm going to go full screen on this now that I've showed you guys that. That's all I wanted to show. Uh, the Venom He Was Hiding. We've got a little bit of the second song just to lead into it because the transitions are so clean. Uh, but yeah, this is another 10-minute track. Let's see how he does it keeping me hooked. This is a nice change of pace. This is different than I thought. Crack my neck on that one. Mm. Mm. This is good. I like this a lot. So far, this is my favorite one already. I highly suggest that you guys go listen to this with headphones because there's so many tiny noises and effects that you don't get to hear.
there's a lot happening in this song. It's kind of similar to the last song, and like we're turning up. We're definitely getting a lot more of the metal side of things right now. Um, I like it. Like I'm here for it. It sounds really good. like this change of pace again i've been saying that a lot but you're speeding it up you're slowing it down at like the perfect times for the listener because for me <laughs> for me at least right when i feel like i'm getting bored it changes up that time i wasn't even bored yet i was just trying to give it a thought out but God, that, that came in unexpected. That was hard.
sometimes I don't even know how to react facial expression wise. Like there's so much going on and it's changing so fast. It might not look like I'm excited at points, but it's really just like I'm overstimulated and I'm trying to sort out all the different sounds that I'm hearing. Because I know it might sound, obviously it's complex, but like through headphones, when you're listening this through headphones, especially studio headphones, like you're hearing every little nuance and every little vocal and little noise that he wanted us to hear. It sounds really, really good. And honestly, I'm just getting a little overstimulated at points, which is why like I'm just kind of looking around or staring off into space. There, it's almost like, it's almost fun trying to wrap my head around how you came up with these different noises, what you sampled, where they came from. I'm a sucker for guitar solos, so that shit was hitting. It's it's a killer. back to our main screen here uh another solid track this one i i started off by saying yeah this is my favorite track i think i still want to stick by that the guitar solo was better than the last song in my opinion i thought the noises and the sampling that we did in this song were stellar um i really really liked that opening with the guitar i thought that was a really nice sound as well i think that's what really did it for me um but you did it again. You kept me entertained throughout the 10-minute song. There were a few points where I was like, hmm, where are we at in this song? But then it was like, it was changing right back up again to where it was like, oh my god, there's so much to focus on. There's so many points where I start getting overstimulated because I'm listening to this song and it's like, I'm hearing this noise in my left ear, I'm hearing this noise in my right ear. I'm sorry, I keep hitting my microphone, making horrible noises. But I'm hearing so many sounds at once that it's like I have to decipher them and try and figure them out in my brain it's it's overstimulating at times but i'm really really liking uh the music so far it keeps me excited to know what's coming next uh the next song is called suicide waltz and then we have a song after that that's about 20 minutes long that's gonna be crazy if i can keep my attention through that 20 minute span um then that's a spectacular job so far so good let me know what you thought about this video down in the comments below. Uh, after you're done with that, go hit the description and show love to the artist. If you want to listen ahead, go ahead and go to their page. They got the whole album posted up on their YouTube. Um, so if you want to get ahead of me and listen to 4, 5, and 6 for the tracks before I do, go ahead and get right to it. I ain't stopping you. But show love to the artist. They're doing great. Keep up the great work. I can't wait to get back with the fourth track.